Worried by the recent attack by unknown gunmen in some parts of Bodo community in Gukana local government area of River State, stakeholders including traditional rulers, security agencies working to foster peaceful coexistence in the state have re-strategized and commit, committed to improving synergy to strengthen the peace-building process in the community. The report. <laughs> The traditional institution in Bodo community has administered oaths taken to some youth of the community in order to end killings in the area. Speaking in an interview with journalists, the community development chairman, John Val, said the process should not be lopsided, but advocate for justice in Bodo. From what happened today, people can confirm what I said by fears that the peace process may be lopsided and true to it is because if you can observe after the oath taken today was meant for oath taking and after the oath taken everybody left some people refused to take the oath i don't know what is on their minds why they refuse to take the oath but i still believe that since it is a peace process it will the former Niger Delta ex-agitator Solomon Ndigbara advised the Bodo community youth to desist from gun battle amongst themselves. Child, they advise the youth of Bodo to receive from shooting gun, to be a fine, that this oath is not a joke. Those that take oath will use us to find those that did not take oath, that did not want the peace. I'm not going to leave it that way. We are going to make sure that the peace continues to be finished. This is an oath of peace. Everybody, those who are away and those who are home, there is going to be a kind of unification. And in this unification, there will be an oath of peace, whereby on your own voluntarily, you take the oath. As you are coming in, you are going to live peacefully with your brothers. You are not going to be part of anything that will be detrimental to the development of this community, Bodo City. However, our correspondent reports that after the oath taken, King John Barabon appeared for the first time at Town Square, one year after the Bodo crisis, to address his people, but was later disrupted by youth. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.